Hello there. It's Thursday, and I should have done this yesterday because I went to Aldi yesterday. But you know what? I'm a day late. I don't care. You probably don't care. So let's just get right into the review, shall we? And now I've decided to finally add some rating factors to my reviews so that they have more meaning, they make more sense. So the first factor is going to be based on packaging and appearance. Does it look pleasing to the eye? Is it easy to spot out in the aisle, etc, etc. The second factor is going to be about the taste or overall quality of said product. The third factor is going to be about how much you paid for it, not including tax. That means each product I review can have a maximum point value of 15 out of 15. Segoy! So today I will be reviewing the Southern Grove Dried Fruit Medley, and if you look on the package, it says that it contains pineapple, banana chips, papaya, golden raisins, raisins, and coconut. So I have it right here in my hand. Um, sealed, of course. I didn't want to open it before I did this review. Especially because I notice on the package contents it says cut or tear here. Oh, on both sides apparently. I don't know if you can see that. Cut or tear here. A smart person would go get some scissors and just cut it open, but I'm not so smart. And I, I want to test the, the whole uh, package appearance. I want to test to make sure that it's it says what it says, or it's true on what it says. Here we go. <sighs> Almost. Nice. Okay, so now we have it open. Um... It, okay, okay, so the first thing I see <laughs> is a whole bunch of bananas. Just lots of bananas in there. There's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with having too many bananas, I, I guess. But um, let's just screw it. It's a trail mix, or it's a fruit medley, but I consider it a trail mix. So let's just grab our hand, go right in here, and grab, damn it, it's mainly bananas. What the frick? So in my hand, I grabbed three banana chips. Uh, it looks like three pineapple pieces, a golden raisin. I think that's a golden raisin. <laughs> is wait, let me, let me let me show you. Is is this a golden raisin? I'm pretty sure that's a golden raisin. Um, and then a regular raisin. Uh, so we're just gonna. Okay, so, ooh, that's interesting. That is very interesting. Um, that was a lot of banana. I, I did not expect that much banana. And because the banana texture is so tough, it's so hard compared to the other uh, types of fruit in there, um, it kind of devalues the, the, ta the taste, in my opinion. I can't speak. The, the taste is devalued because there's too many bananas. That's, that's what I'm trying to get at. Okay. Thank you. So let's head to our final thoughts. With the packaging, it's very nice, it's very colorful. You get to see uh, the actual ingredients inside before you buy it, so that's good. Uh, clear nutrition facts, all the ingredients on the back. Although, I think it's a really bright green, so it might, well, I don't know. Uh, the lettering, the lettering of the actual, con of the title of the uh, product is blended in with the rest of the package. So because of that, I'm gonna give it a four out of five for appearance wise. Could I pick it out in an aisle pretty easily? Probably, but I, I think they should do a different color for the text. Just my opinion. Taste, now the taste was, was difficult because I mainly received banana chips in my first handful. Uh, I'm sure if I had papaya and less banana, the taste would be more even, but because the banana chips are way, way hard compared to the other fruits, which, I mean, they're supposed to be their banana chips. Uh, I'm also gonna give the, t I'm gonna give the taste a four out of five, mainly because there's too many bananas in here. So, that, you know, if there were less bananas and more of the soft, chewy fruits in there, I think it would be a five out of five. And now we come to price. So, uh, 169 for this fruit medley for this, uh, how many ounces is this? This is 7.5 ounces. That's actually pretty good com compared to some of the other trail mix or fruit medleys that you would find in other stores, which would go for, uh, 239 or higher. I'm not going to name any store names in case they hate me for that, but you know, I'm just, I'm just saying. And it is an off-brand, it is Southern Grove, so, um, but once again, so many damn banana chips. Uh, <laughs> I personally think that this product should be 149 because you get so many banana chips, uh, uh, you know, 
in comparison to the other ingredients listed on here. Because of that, I would say the price is a three out of five. What does that mean? That means that the fruit medley gets a total of, that's right, 11 out of 15. Congratulations. Now, would I recommend you to go buy this product when you go to Aldi next time? Yes, anything um, with a score of 10 or higher is definitely worth it. I'd probably buy it again. And next time you go to Aldi, you should check it out. And that's it for me. Bye-bye.